Hello folks and welcome. So I have a troubleshooting video for you today. This was requested by a subscriber. The subscriber um, mentioned a problem that uh, when they are coming out of suspend mode that their panel bar icons are missing, possibly even their desklets. And uh, I will show you how to address that several ways without uh, doing the drastic thing of what the user mentioned was to turn off the power to their machine. I have a little bit better method than that, and you can do that while you're still logged in. Okay, and then I'm going to also, toward the latter part of the video, also talk about if you are using transparent panel bar, and some of you folks are, and your transparency goes away. That's after you uh, enter suspend mode and come out of suspend mode, or possibly the screensaver. Okay. So a couple things about troubleshooting today. Filming in 1920 by 1080, welcome folks. Adjust your YouTube player accordingly. This is Linux Mint 21.3 Cinnamon. Down here in the corner, if you'd like to subscribe, is an icon with a person with yellow brackets. I'm going to open up uh, Bob's computer here. It's our made up user for today and give you some screenshots. Now, I, instead of Bob, decided to take and put Linux Mint 21.3 on five computers. Three of them have this problem and the other two do not. So these are screenshots that have errors on them. How I duplicated that is to go into suspend mode on all three and they came out of this uh, with missing panel bars and some of them have missing and uh, different scenarios. All right, so uh, what causes these kind of problems? It's uh, I'm not here to diagnose uh, what causes that, but possible issues could be the driver, the type of graphics card, the model number, or power management on the motherboards. All five of these computers were different. One of them was a laptop. All right, so these all came off of tower computers and they all have the problem when I entered um, suspend mode and came out of it. The first screenshot is here. And um, the I know this is a black screen, so it may be hard to discern, but this desk lid here was a white one on this screenshot. You can clearly see my custom icons are there and the Mint logo is there, but you don't see the time and date and the Mint menu is gone. So this is one scenario. The second scenario, this is a different system and a different motherboard, different graphics card, and it gave me a bunch of uh, squiggly looking colored icons that can't even discern what these are. They look like colored dots. That one did not have a desklet. All right. Third scenario is this computer that I'm filming from today. This is the exact desklet that you're looking at right here is that looking medical symbol plus and there's no time and date there's no mint menu these are all full screenshots these are all done by entering suspend mode and coming out of suspend mode so again the i'm not here to diagnose the exact scenario of what's going on with these graphic cards or motherboards i'm just showing you how to fix this so you can move on without turning on and off your computer so I will be talking about actions also. That tool is only found on 21.3. And I'm going to start with power. So we're going to, since I used out of the five uh, computers in the pool was a laptop, I'm also going to address that one because you could possibly see that on the laptop also. What am I doing here? I'm opening up system settings on this tower computer and comparing it to the laptop. All right, so a tower computer is defined as a computer with an external monitor. A laptop obviously has the screen built right into it. So power management, uh, you can see that I have suspend in here turned off. But let's say you got yours turned on. So you may exhibit this problem possibly, possibly. This does not happen on all computers, but since the subscriber had asked for this video, I thought I'd uh, just cover some different bases today. So these are the settings on a tower computer and this is for a laptop. And you can clearly see that I have suspend options here that I could click on. And also when the computer lid is closed, it definitely goes into suspend mode on this machine. 
So you could possibly see that on your laptop also. So in that case, I'm going to talk about some fixes that you can return your panel without using that nasty power button. We're going to first address some tools that you can put on your desktop. Yeah, there's an actual setting that you can restart Cinnamon right here. So I'll be restarting Cinnamon several times today. Let me do the first one right now. And what you're going to see is the panel bar blank. I'm not editing this video and I'm going to keep talking while this is doing this. It's restarting Cinnamon right now. Panel bar just blanked. I'll do it one more time. That's the second time I just restarted Cinnamon. So this tool can be placed on your system, laptop or tower computer, doesn't matter, under actions. What you're looking for is in here, type in in the search field RES. You're looking for Restart Cinnamon. So install that. So it's uh, got an icon that looks like a check mark. Then once it's in here, you activate it by hitting plus. And this will place this in your menu by right clicking on your desktop which allows you to right click and restart because you don't have a panel, right? Now you can certainly right click on the panel when you can see it to do troubleshooting and I'm going to restart Cinnamon again. You can certainly do that. However, in the case in point scenario, what this subscriber was describing was the panel wasn't here. How do you restart Cinnamon without a panel? This is one way. Now I'm going to talk about the other two. If you'd like to get out your screenshot tool, uh, be my guest. I'm just, this is a very uh, small document that I wrote, very small. Okay. These have been around for years. They're no big mystery. I didn't create these, but uh, control, hold it down, then press alt, hold it down, and then press the escape key. All right, I'm going to do that. Holding down the control key, holding down the alt, and pressing escape restarting cinnamon. I'll do it one more time. Holding down control, alt and escape. Restarted cinnamon. So my favorite is actually this one because it's a shorter keystrokes is alt and F2. Now a lot of you folks have the F2 on laptops pre-assigned to brightness so just be aware of that. You may have to use function alt and F2. But you're going to uh, enter the small letter R. So I'm going to do that for you. Holding down the alt, pressing the F2. Again this is one of my favorites. And uh, it grays everything else out except for the center. It says enter a command, blinking. Press escape to close. Small letter R, enter, restarting cinema. If you decide Alt and F2 to put the large letter R, you will get a failure. Failed to execute child process. So just change that to a small R. All right, so now you just saw several different scenarios to restart cinema without powering down your system or logging it in and out even. Well, if you don't have a panel, how do you log out? So uh, now I'm going to talk to the people that are using transparent panel. It's an option. So I'm going to change the wallpaper background to something colorful. I'll use that one, grease. All right, so I'm using a semi-transparent panel currently. So right-click, system settings, extensions. This is called transparent panels. If you come out of suspend mode, and uh, maybe you do have a panel, but the panel bar, even with this on, looks like this. It's dark. It's black. It's whatever theme you're using. And you know you have this tool turned on. This does happen occasionally also. And it's not transparent or semi-transparent. This is fully transparent. Now the icons are floating. You see the whole building through it. But more importantly, um, how do you address this when the panel is dark? And you're saying, wait a minute, I just turned that tool on. But you came out of screensaver mode or suspend mode. All right, so first of all, it will, I'm going to simulate it by doing that. So that's what you're seeing here, but this is turned on, is what I'm saying. You restart Cinnamon with the same thing. It's either Alt and F2, small r enter, control, alt, and escape, or right clicking on your desktop if you have that tool turned on. All right, so for another scenario on the same lines, I'm going to make this dark, is uh, the bubble that appears over icons when you point at them, if they're missing, 
like the Firefox, the file manager files and terminal. If these are not here, restart cinnamon. Again, you can use any one of those commands that I do, or you could do it here. Hopefully you found this troubleshooting video um, informative and useful. Maybe some way down the road you may have to use it. Then I would recommend subscription. Take care, folks.